was afraid I'd blown my chance at riding a jump buck for a second. Prince, you need to learn to control yourself. Quit nagging me. We got what we came for, right? But I was hoping we'd have more time to hunt for parts. The wannabe junkers may be gone, but the defenders are still around. So don't even think about coming in here alone. I know, I know. I'd never be that reckless. <laughs> Probably. So the battleship crash landed in these mountains, huh? That's right. It hit the ground with such force that debris was scattered all over the area. That thing must be super tough to mostly survive a landing like that. I hope I get a chance to inspect it someday. Could be the discovery of the century. Considering how conspicuous they are, I highly doubt that. Aren't you a killjoy? But I bet you I'm number one when it comes to finding the treasure inside it. Right, old man? Perhaps, assuming there's treasure to be found. That's a backhanded way to put it. I'll make a big find someday. Just watch. Good grief. If only he were as enthusiastic about studying. Royal Army soldiers all over Sandland? There's even a bunch near our village. Most of them are stationed near the Royal Capital. It can be a lot more hit and miss the farther you get away from them. You'll also see supply units traveling around as they transport goods to bases. Those are probably the ones who passed near our village.
What's wrong? Aren't you going in? I am. It's just there's an urgent news bulletin on the radio now. Oh? Prince, we'd best listen too. Okay. Yesterday, a Royal Army tank was hijacked from that base by unknown saboteur. Hmm? Huh? The perpetrators have gone on a rampage with their stolen tank, looting vital water supplies and destroying several towns. What? What the? Anyone who has recently sighted a suspicious tank should contact the Royal Army immediately. Any information about the culprit's identities or whereabouts is welcome. Moreover, the king is offering a 30 million zenny reward for the capture of the saboteurs, dead or alive. What? <clears throat> but we didn't do any of that. Uh, of course. I mean, Mayor Tor trusts you guys, so... <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. How could the Royal Army sink so low? They have turned the entire world against us. Unless we find the spring, we'll have to spend the rest of our lives on the run. That's pretty horrible of them to put a bounty on your head. Our only hope is to find that spring as soon as we can. Let's abandon the tank and forget all about this. We got lucky. They still don't know who we really are. Some demon you are, thief. Don't be such a coward. But, Prince! I'll keep looking for the spring all on my own if I have to. No turning back now. I'll come too. We're basically partners in crime at this point. Let me be clear. I'm not turning back until I've seen that spring with my own eyes. If you can't handle that, then go home already. But, but... What will everyone say if they see me return without you? Don't be a worry, Wart Gramps. I'm sure things will work out. Once the jump bot's ready, I just know we'll find the spring. How can you be so sure? You're a gutsy one, aren't you? Do you think Anne's fine working on that jump bot all on her own? None of us know what we're doing. We'd only get in her way if we tried to help. We're better off getting some rest for the journey ahead. <laughs> we're going to be aimlessly wandering through the southern desert with an entire army on our tail. Don't worry. I lived in the south 30 years ago, so I at least know the general lay of the land there. Ah, 30 years ago. You mean, back when the Peachy still inhabited the area? That would be about the time the Royal Army wiped them all out, wouldn't it? Yeah, about that time. Such a tragedy. That made my list of the top 10 most foolish things humanity has ever done. Foolish? but it prevented the Peachy from destroying all of Sandland with their Doomsday Weapon. Really? You actually believe that? The Peachy were really developing a machine that made water. What? Water? N no, that can't be true. It's true, all right. The brilliant Peachy were trying to create massive quantities of water. Not just for themselves, but to share with everyone. And 
because the royal army's profits would go up in smoke if that happened. They got rid of the peachy first. The massive explosion that happened when they were attacked was caused by the aquinium they needed to make their machine work. Which the royal army gave them knowing what would happen. And the Royal Army used a massive Aquanium bomb to wipe out every last one of them. No, but how can this be? The commander of the tank brigade that attacked them, who ordered the shots that set off the Aquanium, was me. Resulting explosion destroyed almost my entire village. And everyone in my whole brigade, apart from me, was killed in an instant. The army thinks I died back then, too. They, they made us attack, knowing it would cause that explosion. Wait, if they knew, why would they make your tanks attack inside the blast radius? Two birds with one bomb. Our brigade never much liked Supreme Commander Zeus' methods. We spoke our minds too much. Oh, <laughs> well, not your fault, huh? You had no idea. Sh sure, you thought you were saving the world, right? Then, the Peachy were really developing a machine that made water. The real fiend here. And the Royal Army used a massive Aquanium bomb to wipe out every last one of them. Is actually me. What in the world? I'm absorbing the power of darkness. Because it looks like we're in for a fight. Right? Ooh, that's news hit the spot. All right. I think I'll check on Anne to see how the jump bot's coming along. Watch this. Nice, huh? I picked up a core frame in pretty decent shape at the Lisop Junkers Market. That's funny. It's the same model as my old car. Oh, really? A junk. He said that he bought it off a bunch of bandits with diamond face paint. Those thieves, they'll do just about anything to turn a profit. You mean this used to be your car? It would seem so. Oh, in that case, 
You should have it. Are you sure? Don't sweat it. I had fun putting it together. And I owe you guys a ton anyway. You're too kind. Thank you. Oh, man! I sure wish I had my own car! I can make you one, too, if you bring me a frame. <sighs> Your eyes are bloodshot. Did you not sleep? Not a wink. I stayed up all night making the car. So you've been slacking on the jump bot to do that instead? It's not like I didn't try, you know. I've never built one, and it's complicated enough that I'll need a blueprint. Are you serious? Oh, man. It's a highly specialized bot, so I'm not surprised. If you're after a blueprint, I think Mayor Tor just might have what you need. Didn't he mention that the rebel army had left some files on jump bots behind? Oh, yeah. The mayor'd be the person to ask. I'm impressed you managed to remember that. Oh, ho, ho. when it comes to memory, no other demon can match me. Hey, would you happen to have the jump bot blueprints? Blueprints? No, I, I don't have anything like that. Great. Didn't you mention there being some documentation on jump bots in the files the rebels left behind? Oh, you're right. Let me go fetch them real quick. Found them! This what you need? So you have the blueprints after all! Is it all right if we borrow these for a bit? Be my guest. Thanks! Anne, we brought the blueprints. They really had exactly what we needed. This should do the trick. I'll get started right away. Hope I have enough parts. Can't believe you really made it. What you talking about? You didn't think she could? I'll be honest. I had my doubts. You must have had a fine mentor. No mentor for me. I'm completely self-taught. Just picked up what I could here and there. There's just always been a lot for me to tinker around with. Incredible. In any case, this should allow us to slip past the army and continue on our journey south. 
You know, it's awfully fitting that we made a bot to outfox the Royals at the Rebel Army's ex-base. Almost like it's fate. All right then, let's get a move on already. If you have any problems with the bot, come back for repairs anytime. Thanks. Prince, before we head to the East Valley, let's scout the Southern Road. What for? I want to see what the army might be...